What's the difference between the Barazza Virtuoso Plus and the Barazza Encore automatic coffee grinders? We're going to show you today on FrenchPressCoffee.com. Hi everyone, I'm Brian with FrenchPressCoffee.com. Thank you as always for tuning in to our virtual coffee shop, where today we're talking about the differences between the Barazza Virtuoso Plus and Barazza Encore automatic coffee grinders, and I'm going to dive right in with the most common question that we get from folks out there in TV land, which is, which of these grinders should I get? So we're going to help you to answer that question, talk, talk about some similarities, differences, and then wrap it all up for you to hopefully help you to make an informed decision. There's a lot of similarities between the Virtuoso Plus and the Encore grinders. They both feature 40 millimeter stainless steel conical burrs. And there's 40 different grind sizes on each of these, ranging from fine to coarse. They both have 8 ounce bean hoppers, which are made from UV resistant plastic. And these uh, containers for grounds are both 5.1 ounces or 145 grams. They both have the same internal gear system. They both have on-demand grind buttons. Both the Encore and Virtuoso are designed to be entry-level grinders for people who are either looking to dip their toes into the world of burr grinders or are drip, pour over, or manual coffee drinkers and don't need the precision of a dedicated espresso grinder. The first difference is one that I've spoken about in another video here on the channel, and that's going to be in the conical burr grinder that you're going to find in each of these. The Virtuoso Plus features the M2 burr, and the Encore features the M3 burr, and there is a distinct difference between each of those in the edge that you're going to find on the grinder. Now the key difference between those two conical burrs and what they're going to give you in your coffee grind is going to be that in the Virtuoso Plus with that M2 conical burr, you're going to find a more even and consistent grind and you're going to be able to get a more fine grind. So this is going to be more well suited for grinding espresso. Now the burrs between both of these are the same size and made of the same material. They're 40 millimeters each and they're both made of stainless steel. One important note, if you are looking specifically to grind espresso and get that really fine espresso grind, then I would consider jumping to the Barazza Seta grinder, which we have spoken about here on the channel before, and you can check out videos for that right here on French Press Coffee. Both of these grinders are great all-around grinders, meaning that they're going to be very well suited to grinding from espresso all the way to French Press ground coffee. However, there is a difference between these two grinders and the grind range that they're going to be capable of. The Barazza Encore is going to be able to grind between 250 to 1200 microns, and the Barazza Virtuoso Plus is going to be able to get a little more accurate, grinding from 200 to 1400 microns. Second key difference between these two machines is going to be in the grind speed. The Virtuoso Plus is going to grind at 500 RPM and the Encore is going to grind at 450 RPM. So the bottom line there is that the Virtuoso Plus is going to be a faster grinder overall. Third key difference between these two grinders is going to be in the operation of them. On the Virtuoso Plus, you've got a timer right in the center of the device and you can turn this knob to select your grind time and then just simply press it in and then step away let the grind happen on the encore there's two different ways of grinding you can hold down the button on the front which is great for on-demand grinding just hold that down until you're done grinding let go and it's finished or if you want to be able to start the grind and step away from it you can use the switch that is on my left hand side of the unit. However, this is going to mean that you're going to need to babysit the machine a little bit. So if you're looking for convenience, the Virtuoso Plus is definitely going to give that to you over the Encore. Fourth key difference between these two grinders is just the overall design. You're going to notice that the Virtuoso Plus definitely has a more stylish design. You've got this brushed aluminum faceplate right here. Of course, as I say, you have the timer built in, which also has a digital LCD screen. And just overall, it also weighs a little bit more, and that's going to lead to it making a little less noise when grinding. But don't count on absolute no noise from either of these. They're coffee grinders. They're going to make some noise. The Encore Again, it's a little more basic, primarily all plastic, obviously, on the front. Does not have that LCD screen. It's got that on-demand button. Uh, but if you're looking for something that's good and just going to get the job done, the Encore, again, is going to do that well. If you need something a little more flashy, looks good on the countertop, Virtuoso Plus is a great uh, decision for that. 
So what's my bottom line to come back to that most common question that we get here at FrenchPressCoffee.com, which is, which of these grinders should I get? My bottom line is this. If you are looking to grind espresso and get those finer grinds, more consistent grinds, spend a little less time grinding, and get the convenience and, of course, the looks uh, of an upgraded coffee grinder, then you would want to look at the Virtuoso Plus. Now, I should also mention, as I did, if you're looking to primarily grind and therefore drink espresso, you probably want to take a look at the Barazza Seta grinder. Find the link to that one in the description of this video. Now, I'm not going to downplay, however, the Barazza Encore. This is still a great grinder. It's a very economical grinder. It's going to come in at a lower price point than other grinders, and it's a great overall grinder. It's going to give you a very consistent grind, allowing you to go, yes, from espresso all the way to French press. Just happens to be that it has a slightly uh, lower grind range. That could be very important for some folks, and especially if you're looking to do espresso and really finely ground coffee. And it doesn't have all the bells and whistles that the Virtuoso Plus does. It's a little more hands-on, even for an automatic grinder. You still are going to have to babysit it just a little bit. But overall, this is an excellent grinder. If you are looking to get into the world of automatic coffee grinding, and you need something that's a great starter grinder, or even one that's going to last you for quite some time, the Encore is a good bet. The Virtuoso Plus just happens to have some great step-up options to it that will probably appeal to folks who like some of the finer, ha, that's a good pun, things in life. So there you have it, everyone. That's the Barazza Virtuoso Plus versus the Barazza Encore coffee grinder. I hope that you found this video helpful uh, in your search for the perfect coffee grinder. But remember, if you have questions and we haven't answered all of them here in this video, make sure to get in touch with us. Find the links in the description of this video. Visit us at FrenchPressCoffee.com. Leave us a comment. We always like to hear from you because we're here to help and help you get a great cup of coffee at FrenchPressCoffee.com. I'm Brian. Thanks for tuning in. I'll see you next time and take care. Well, if you like that video, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any more highly caffeinated videos. And if you do, I'll give you a great coffee quote. Go on. I'll wait. There you go. Thank you so much. And now for the quote. Coffee is definitely my cup of tea.